hello everyone welcome back to vloggers day 13 i want to say i can't believe like we're nearly halfway through august and i've really been enjoying it i've really been having a lovely time um i thought when i was thinking about doing it i really talked myself out of it i was like how like am i even gonna film enough like there is nothing going on really and then as the months progress like I'm going to the theatre now at the end of the month, going to the Eras tour. Um, we've done like a few little fun days out and stuff. And I don't know, it just naturally has worked out. Like in even the cosy days at home, I feel like I'm enjoying filming. I just am really, really liking it. Finding the time to edit is tricky. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do it actually when we go to the Eras tour unless I try and pre-film a video, but I'm kind of running out of time for that. Um, Cause obviously I can't really film and I've got the kids around like a proper video. Um, but anyway, I've just run upstairs because we're having a bit of a cozy morning. It is drizzly and gray today, which is making me very happy. It's also making me want to just click my fingers and have the house completely renovated because I would love nothing more than to have like a perfectly lovely, beautiful done kitchen to light an autumnal candle and just bake cookies <laughs> um, rather than my uh, granny Alex kitchen but you know we'll get there one day I'm filming on my phone by the way because my camera is charging so if the quality is a bit different or if we're a bit close or I don't know that is why I can't see because I've got it on the back camera because it's better quality anyway bye okay, so I've just brought Otis up for his nap I have got all of this look you see all of that washing to put away but i kind of have been putting not putting it off i've not really had much of a chance but i feel like i need to do another sort out of stuff that doesn't fit him like these leggings nine to twelve months i think they're a goner and like this sleep suit not sleep suit vest i mean i think this does fit to be fair because it's like these ribbed ones i find are so stretchy and lovely quality so i think then is it weird to break up the set do these leggings still fit him oh i don't know i don't know so we've booked i can't remember if i've what i've really said so my friend i didn't vlog yesterday did i so i um i've probably not spoken about this if I have, I'll have to edit out. So, my friend came over yesterday, who I'm going with, and we sorted out hotel and parking. So we're going to drive down. She's going to drive us down. She's got an electric vehicle, so she'll be fine in, like, the ULES bit. But we're not actually driving into... Well, I would have to pay because my car's very old. But basically, we are... We've got a... Um, just a travel lodge about half an hour out of Wembley and we've actually booked it for the night before the concert and the night of the concert um, because it was literally £33 for the first night and £40 £43 or something for the second night so for both nights we've paid £76 and we are splitting it between us so we were like, for the sake of an extra £15 each for that first night, even if we don't actually go up on that first night, we just get there in the morning or whenever. It just gives us, it means we can get there, get our stuff there, get checked in and get ready in a space. Like, because otherwise we'd either be getting ready here and driving down, which isn't, hey, 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 cheeky bum. Trying to put washing away with this kid, taking it all out. Um... Yeah, which these drawers do not have room for these clothes right now. I really need to take it all out. Um, I'm sick of it being on the window still. I feel like it's going to cause like damp or something. Um, what am I saying? Yeah, because otherwise we could get ready before we drive down, but we'd be getting ready really early because we'd be driving down really early to make sure we didn't like get stuck in traffic and things. Um, so, yeah, we've booked two nights hotel and then we've booked pop. Oh, it is. Oh, he's shutting the wardrobe doors as I'm trying to put stuff in it. Yeah, so we've paid for parking £28 on someone's drive who lives a 10 minute walk from the stadium, arena, stadium, whichever one it is. Um, so all in all, for the tickets, they were £150 for the two. 
um like face value which is so lucky this late in the day i know like i'm literally seeing tickets worse than ours being sold for like 500 pound each like it's insane how much people are charging um so yeah basically with the fees and things it was near i think it was 190 pounds for the tickets for two tickets so basically it cost us 300 pounds for both of us for the hotels like two nights hotel parking and tickets um so 150 pound each 150 pound all in and then obviously just whatever it costs to charge her car like up and down I, I don't really know what that costs um but how good like I mean it's still a lot of money like obviously it's a lot of money and I can't help but think we could literally go on a caravan holiday for that like that's where my head's at I'm like oh it'd be so nice let's have that money sports family adventures but I feel like this is a bit of a once in a lifetime opportunity you know shut those curtains and turn on your light Ooh, cozy time it's cozy time it is you put your sleeping bag in here where's my otis oh, hello you where's your oh Mm. Oh, is it yours? Mwah. Have a good sleep, baby boy. Have a good sleep. What have you got? A saucepan lid in your brother's kitchen? A day. Zip. Zip, zip, zip. Good night, baby. Good night. I love you so much. Good night. Mwah. I need to make that one better. I can add some new songs to that one. Yeah. And how do we turn it on? Do you press an ear? Yeah. This one goes in the mellow one. And this one goes in the yellow one. No, this one goes in oh, the mellow one. Silly bummy. Three yellow ones. Yeah. Should we do three? Oh, four yellow ones. Two red ones. Next, we need one yellow and two others. How many yellow are there now? One, two, three. tall like the yellow one yeah. yeah let's make the blue one tall as well silly bum okay we're gonna pull that oh woo. should we play a different game yeah go okay let's have these ones then help me they got we didn't know i am now all right you're doing so good oh bye <laughs> no, right, start, which one should we do? This one. This one? Mm -hmm. So good at the Mickey Mouse castle, wasn't it? Yeah, really good castle. We loved it, didn't we? We want to look on there to For your bedroom? Yeah. Uh, Oh, see, Oh, you want to see some Disney pictures? Yeah. Okay, let's do that then. <laughs> this face. Perfect. Can you do this face? <laughs> Great one. Can you do this face? Are you crying? <laughs> what about this face? <laughs> Great one. What about this face? What is he? Um, <laughs> and this face? <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> Give me a high five. <laughs> Buzzy is yeah. Oh no, Buzzy. He's on fire. The colours are on fire. Let's go. Nino, 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 Nino. I'll add her up there. You know what today is, Buzz? Yeah. It is the race day on the race track. Yeah. So we need to find our best racing cars we've got up here. Oh. What's our best racing cars? Oh. Blue one's getting away. Mate has popped a tyre, Buzz. Oh. oh no. Mechanical, go fix him. You need to fix him. Breath 
Blue Kaiser winner. Woo! Green one or red one? Uh, the, uh, red one. Red one, right, okay. Let's stand behind the line on your marks. Oh, wait, no cheating. On your marks. Get set. Go! Oh my goodness! Is <laughs> <laughs> some dino sorting. I got this from Amazon a while ago like almost maybe two years ago i don't know that sounds like, yeah maybe actually um and it's had red so red. much play you've so done all the red i think there's a few more you know what do you reckon are you going to do a different color now purple. getting some purple ones and do you know what he's never really taken to using the tweezer bits before but this time he's just using them now it's five oh. you're doing good concentrating the color next yellow mm -hmm. What colour is your favourite colour? Yellow. Yellow is my favourite colour as well. And do you know what colour Daddy's favourite colour is? Green. He likes green and orange are his favourite colours. Mm. I wonder what Otis's favourite colour is? Uh, orange. Do you think he's orange as well? Yeah, I love the yellow bit like Otis. <laughs> I love you. What colour eyes have you got? Let me see. <gasps> Blue. Still blue eyes. Still blue. And what colour eyes have I got? You've got white eyes, blue eyes, black eyes. Oh, what colour lips have I got? Red. And what colour teeth have I got? Red. Still red. What colour tongue have I got? Red. You've <laughs> <laughs> uh, called an a patasaurus. Patasaurus. Yes, let's Can you say that one? A plesiosaurus. Perfect. Good try. Hello. Right. Buzz is just starting off building a magnetiles castle. My <laughs> it's, it's ridiculous, but it was so hot earlier. Um, Otis is still napping, and I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea. I feel like I use this mug all the time. I'm just, you know, honeys. <laughs> How the manifesting work for Taylor Swift. <laughs> manifesting this now. Um, but yeah, we've been having such a nice time playing. Obviously, I get quality time with Otis when Buzz is at nursery. Um, so I really try to use... Sorry, it's going to get noisy. But yeah, I really try to use nap times to do the same for Buzz. Sorry, the kettle is noisy. Um, but yeah, I feel like I always say on here, like, oh, we've just been doing some playing, this and that. But... I don't film it all that much because it's probably not very interesting to watch but I thought I'd film a bit of me and Buzz playing because um, show you some of the toys that he's into at the moment and stuff and I had a H&M delivery yesterday I feel like I get deliveries all the time at the minute it's not it's not a standard practice um, but I ordered a couple more of the t-shirts that I like so just these ones from H&M just to be fair though I ordered the same size that I ordered the grey one in and this one and the other one I've got feels massive I should have sized down but I'm sure I'll shrink it in the wash at some point um, and when I ordered that I also ordered this little fabric toy box thing it's like a storage case that I saw on H&M um, and I thought it'd be perfect to take with us on the little road trip so I'll show you that later if I remember but um, yeah going through the toys in Buzz's bedroom then because we do play in his bedroom often but we quite often end up playing with the same things um, and looking through his toy boxes then there's like so many great things that I've put kind of in his bedroom because they're not necessarily things that I'd want Otis like getting hold of um like downstairs in the downstairs toy storage and also yeah it's just nice for one-on-one -on -one play but then quite often the one-on-one -on -one play we don't tend to do in Buzz's bedroom because I worry about it waking up Otis but Otis went off with us playing next door Buzz was doing the hammering stuff like he didn't make a peep like so I think I don't really need to worry too much about that he's got his music on in there hasn't he so yeah um it got me thinking of the stuff that I might start popping away for our road trip holiday and I might do that sooner rather than later so that when it comes to the road trip holiday he's not seen stuff in a really long time and then it'll feel really new um, and I'll go through Otis's toys in his bedroom as well and pick out some bits as well um but yeah so right let's have a nice cup of tea what time is it it's 25 to 11 25 to 11 mm. yeah I can't drink a big car you can't right well let me quickly make my tea and then i will come and help you how does that sound good all right let's do it 
lunch, some dairy league sandwiches and some fruit. And the same for Buzzy but car sandwiches and salami. Yum, 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 yum. A very quick update from us. We have just driven to the shops. Buzzy is falling asleep. Right, should we get you out? One yeah. out. You're so handsome. They're both so good in the car, bless them. Yeah. Should we put some socks on you first? Doing that classic thing of treating pets at home like a fun day out for the kids. Works every time. Oh, they've got little black tails, those ones. Yeah. And they're snails. Yeah. <laughs> Another little rabbit. Is he so that cute? One, that, one, that one on the roof. Oh, he's on the roof. Yeah. So cute. Not me that's been chatting for about five minutes and just looked at the camera and was like, oh, not even recording. I feel like I'm showing you a lot of things I buy. Like, I've, I'm worried it's coming across as like excessive, but. See, some of the stuff is just like a food shop, which is like, you know, standard. So I hope you don't think I'm like, I don't know, showing too much. And I was going to say, let me know if it's boring. But if you say it's boring, then will I be offended? I don't know. Probably not. I don't know. <laughs> it's so weird putting yourself on the internet, guys, honestly. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to just show you. Um, so I picked up just some little things like this just to have in the cupboard. These were like 89p, I think, for a pack of six. I've already put these in the fridge so <laughs> they're open but I think I've said already that Buzz is like really into cheese strings randomly. Just some little sweets. I thought I'm just as I'm going I'm just stockpiling as I see like affordable things you know for our little trip away. So I'm going to put these in the little kitty for our little camper van trip because um, I just think it will just help you know when it gets near to it then it won't be as much of a thing um, I picked up this I think it was £1.9p or something like that um, I just thought for a rainy day like today like it's just a perfect activity to do with Buzz um, obviously we've got the stuff to make cakes in usually but when it's like this it's just an easy quick one we do bake cakes from scratch like semi-frequently not loads and loads but we do um, but sometimes a little box one it's just what you need. Like, if it's just a little short nap time with Otis and I don't want to get the kitchen all in a mess or whatever, you know? Um, I also picked this up. Our friend had one when we went round the other day. It's like a bubble, it's called a bubble fan. And it has this little tray that you put the bubble mixture in and then you dip this in and then you press it and the, the fan spins and it blows the bubbles. Um, I'm all for <laughs> a bubble situation that the kids can do themselves. I've got a bubble machine actually, but sometimes I feel like they like to do it themselves, but Buzz isn't, can't really like, they're quite tricky to blow through the ones at this age, I feel like. Um, so I feel like I end up doing it all the time. And sometimes it'd be nice if they could do it. Um, so I also picked up this. I'm not gonna say about it because I don't want him to hear, but I, this looks very much like the one we're hiring, I think, um, from what I can remember. So I just thought, again, I'm gonna put it away. I just wanna build it up. I just want it to be exciting. I know you don't need these bits and bobs. Just really excited. Um, and I was wondering whether to get Otis one as well and like keep it as a keepsake, but I was like, realistically, for three pound, it's probably not gonna be the best quality. <laughs> so I don't know, we'll see. I know that they've got them, so I can always grab another one if I want to, but um, yeah, I'm just excited for our little family trip. It's so different to anything we've done before. So same as the cake mix, I also got a cookie mix, just a Betty Crocker one. Um, again, I just like having them in the cupboard. We've not had them in for a really long time. Um, I just like having them like having a rainy day today just made me be like yeah good stuff like that is just always a winner boxes have just opened I think I've squashed them somehow I don't know um I've got us all a new toothpaste just to add to our stockpile I like to just make sure we've definitely got them so Buzz uses the Aquafresh strawberry one he he really hates the mint ones he says it's spicy and he cries um so <laughs> strawberry it is as much as ollie is like trying to get him onto the mint ones but um me and ollie just got that one and then otis i honestly don't know like why this box looks like it's been like it's 10 years old i didn't notice that in the shop i don't know a bit weird anyway just the classic milk tea one so i got it quite recently i can't remember if i was vlogging when i did or not but in the last like couple of months or so um, oh my gosh, I had a nice coffee and I'm feeling like really palpitation. <laughs> I used to do, get this all the time any time I drank coffee and I'm not, I'm, I'm normally pretty good now. Um, ugh. Anyway, I'm okay. Pink stuff. This is like £1.49 and it's a really good stain remover. So 
topped up on that because we are very almost out. And I picked up this Lenore crease, crease releaser. Um, my old one I had for ages. I thought it was rubbish. I think I mentioned this on a video at some point. Um, but then recently, for like the odd crease here or there, or on your bedding, I'm really enjoying it. So I got that. And then lastly, I picked up two of these. One for me and one for my friend. Um, because we've both been looking for them. And neither of our home bargains had them. And I went to a different one today. And so, got one of those. It literally looks like a next one. It was £1.49 so cute um so yeah i won't open the other one because it's the exact same but she definitely lives far away so i have to post it um i wanted to get her some other bits as well to like pop in it like some little chocolates or something because she's been having a really really rough time recently but it had got to that point where i was ready to leave the shop with the kids they were being fine like they were being good as gold but you know when you just know you haven't got long left so um, bless Otis, he was like well overdue his nap by that point as well. So I might nip out tomorrow um, and grab some bits. Um, we'll see. But yeah, hopefully she'll be happy with that and hopefully it won't break. And that is everything I got. Wow, that's a massive one. Oats is going to love this as well. Yeah. <laughs> At me. Whoa. And you guessed it, I'm back in the caravan and I've not yet ended the vlog, so here I am. I don't know what that noise is. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I don't know what that noise is, it's a bit weird. I'll see you soon, tomorrow in fact.